A centrifugal pump converts power into pressure rise to transport liquids from one location to another via piping. A centrifugal pump consists of four main components. The driver, the shaft, the impeller, and the casing. The driver, shown here as an electric motor, connects to one end of the shaft and provides the mechanical power to spin it. The other end of the shaft connects to and turns the impeller, which is located within the casing. Liquid enters the suction side of the pump and travels toward the eye or center of the impeller. The impeller's rotation produces a lower pressure that draws liquid toward the eye. As the impeller spins, centrifugal force moves liquid from the eye outward along the impeller blades toward the inside curved funnel area of the casing, known as the volute. As the liquid travels along the volute, its velocity decreases while its pressure increases. The now higher pressure liquid flows to the discharge port of the pump and out into the piping system. With many different configurations available, centrifugal pumps are widely used because of their design simplicity, efficiency, capacity range, smooth flow rate, and ease of operation and maintenance.